Indian market where a fire broke out at 3.50 a.m. today in the morning. A deadly fire engulfs the bustling Surya Sen market in Kolkata, leaving scores dead and injured. Inflammable materials stacked, narrow lanes and an eatery on the first floor. This six-storied commercial building was a disaster in the making. 30-year-old Swapna Pal is inconsolable. Her husband Gosai Pal was among those charred to death. Five of the 13 bodies identified are from Charkhand. They were sleeping inside the market when the tragedy caught them unawares. <laughs> Of the 22 people who were pulled out of the fire rubble, 19 did not even get an opportunity for treatment. They were declared dead on arrival at various hospitals. But the question is, were no lessons learnt by the Mamta government, which has seen the country's worst hospital tragedy at AMRI Hospital in December 2011? Her government claims that this 22-year-old building was illegal and unauthorised. On the ground, her ministers blame the past policies of the left front government. During these 34 years, this type of unauthorized illegal markets have cropped up in the uh, whole of uh, Kolkata and West Bengal. Why they have not taken action? Why they have allowed it uh, to construct an unauthorized uh, market like this? The left front is to be blamed. Uh, going for blame game for anybody on the side of the government or on the side of the opposition right now here in this spot is an irresponsible job. A probe committee has been formed and will file a report in three days. Meanwhile, other market owners have been given 90 days to follow fire safety measures. After the Amri fire incident, the government requested all buildings to follow safety norms. No one follows the norms. For the city of Kolkata, which has seen deadly fire tragedies in the past, its people are caught between callous owners and an indifferent government. With Shogutu Mukhopadhyay and Priyanka Gupta in Kolkata, in New Delhi, this is Parikshit Lutra.